हेलो हेलो माइक टेस्ट The percent profitability is 70% plus. Profit factor is amazing, which is around 12. And yes, we are making more than 1% in every trade on an average. So it looks like a great strategy. Hello, financial programmers. I'm Rithvik Dashora, and I'm back with a new video and some new learning. This is the fifth video of this playlist. In the first four videos we covered uh, tilted RSI, drift Bollinger Bands, grid trading strategy, and the last one was pullback strategy. And now, if you are interested to make a strategy using Super Trend and Hike in Ashi, then you are at the right place. In this video, we'll be using simple Super Trend uh, indicators, and we'll change the source code of that particular indicator to make a trading strategy. And let's see what. Uh, are the final results and yes for this we will be considering hike in ashi candles rather than the normal candlesticks if you are new to my youtube channel guys on this channel i upload videos related to making pine script trading strategies making full fledged trading bots implementation of ai in finance using some highly valuable finance apis etc etc so if this is something that you are interested in then you should subscribe to my youtube channel and also hit on the bell icon because there is a lot of good content that i have in my pipeline which will be uploaded to my youtube channel in the next 3 months the topics that we are covering today in order to make the hike in ashi super trend trading strategy the first thing that will be doing is will be referring to the super trend source code which is already available on trading view the second is we will clean it as per our requirements then we will make the entry and close conditions including stop loss and then in the end we'll plot everything and uh, do the back testing to analyze the results so without any further ado let's start okay guys so in this terminal you can see that i have selected btc usd which is bitcoin usd exchange price and here let's just consider 45 minutes time interval for the candlesticks calculations and over here just uh, click on the hike in ashi candles here right this is the first thing that you'll have to do now let's start writing the code here so we'll write at the rate version is equal to 5 because we are writing this code in version 5 strategy and then the title of this strategy is super trend strategy you can write any other name as well overlay is equal to 2 because i want to plot all the charts in the main graph here only so um and initial capital is equal to 1000 right uh, let's just uh, write plot is equal to plot and then close and then let's just save it, it will ask us to give a name to the strategy let's keep it super trend strategy video save now <clears throat> we have to get the source code of uh, super trend so if you write super trend here you'll see so we'll just click on this one which is uploaded by kivank and then something i am not able to pronounce this name but yeah you just click on this one and uh, click on this two curly brackets you'll get the entire source code for this particular indicator so let's just copy everything you can see that it's version 4 but we'll convert it and let's come back to our strategy here and let's just uh, paste it here and i think let's uh, do one thing let's change ev everything like this one it will recommend us to change this particular version to version 5 like just click on this light bulb uh, and convert to version 5 it will automatically convert it now from the beginning we'll have to make the strategy again so strategy super trend strategy overlay is equal to 2 initial capital is equal to 1000 i'll delete this one right the periods is equal to an input this is the super trend 1 right i'll copy and paste it again to make two different super trends anyways so let's clean this particular code here i'll just remove all the things which are not required in our case so i think let's uh, maximize this panel let's delete all the lines one by one which are not required periods is important src is not important because i'm just taking close price here we'll see where is this src going it's going here right up and down so i'll just close I'll, i'll just change this up to close and down to close as well let's see now where this is going it's not going anywhere so i'll just delete this section and then uh, apart from this i think everything else is important i will not delete anything else i think i i'll delete this fill section as well alerts is not required this one is also not required right i think yes that's it so i have deleted all the all the lines which are actually unnecessary i can delete this one as well i this is just to print buy or sell right uh, in the in the main chart i am not interested in this because when we'll be making strategy we'll anyways write it over there so we'll delete these two things as well i think that's it right so now let's do one thing this is copy everything here to here and paste it again and let's write super trend 
strategy two. Now we'll have to change all the variables here because uh, these variables are like already being used in super trend one. So I'll just write B in the end of all the variables, right? Right, like this one. So let me just do it. I'll pause this video for a second and then I'll come back. Perfect. So I have uh, uh, written B for, uh, in all the variables here to make it unique for super trend two, right? So we have now two different super trends. Now let's just plot it now. Plot trend B and trend uh, this one. So yeah, now minimize the panel. Let's just save it. Let's see what happens here. I'll have to delete this one and then add to chart. We have, we'll, we'll be getting like no orders here because we are yet to write the, the code for orders. And you can see we have now two different super trends. And on the basis of this, we'll be making the strategy. Now, what is the logic of buy and sell? So basically, whenever both the lines are red or green, we'll be making the trading decisions. If they both are green, then we'll take buy position. If they both are red, then we'll take sell position. So I'll just give an example here. In this case, for example, uh, it would have taken a buy position here and then would have closed it here because one of the super trend is not green anymore. It would have closed the position here. And then because both the super trends are now red, it would have taken a sell position here, which would have been closed here and so on, right? So that's the main idea here. So if both the super trends are green, then we'll buy. If both the super trends are red, then we'll sell. And if any one of uh, the super trends change color, then we'll close the already existing position, whatever the position it is. It might be a long or a short position, right? Perfect. So let me maximize the panel again. Now here we'll have to provide the buy and sell condition. Buy condition final is equal to the trend should be equal to one. And the same goes with the trend B as well. It should also equal, uh, it should also be equal to one only. So I'll just change to this to trend B. And similar to this one, we'll create a cell position final. This should be equal to minus one. And this should also be equal to minus one. Perfect. So now if by final condition, then we'll take the uh, buy order, which is strategy dot entry long. And then direction is strategy dot long. The comment can be long open, right? So this is the long position. If cell condition final, then strategy dot entry, sorry, it should be entry. And then short direction is strategy dot short comment can be short open simple right now let's just save it and let's see what are the results perfect so we have already got a very good result here which is the total number of closed trades a 291 percent profitability is 56.7 percent which is not amazing but yeah it's still acceptable profit factor is 4.122 and the average trade is 1.63 percent which is very good now i am actually interested to increase this as well okay so let's uh, include close conditions here because if we if you see on the chart there is a situation let me just maximize this one there is a situation when one of the super trend has changed the color right so we have to close our position in that case right so i'll just write a close position here if okay maximizing it strategy dot position size is greater than zero and any one of this trend uh, is equal to minus one this or this equal to minus one and in that case just close that particular position which is long right and we'll write comment as long close and same goes with short as well if strategy dot position size is less than zero and any one of these trends um, are equal to one then in that case strategy dot close short and then comment is short close simple i'm interested to see what is the result so i'll just save it okay so we have actually got better results now it's 62.36 percent profit factor is amazing uh, this is also very good the average trade is also good i am actually concerned about this one now maximum drawdown should be less than um, 50 percent at least and this should be more than 70 percent so i'll have to incorporate the stop loss as well but this is guys before that i have a very important information to share recently i launched my course on python for financial programming so so if you guys are learning python from scratch and are confused in your journey then you should go to my website which is fpritvik.com slash python the link is in the description box and click on any one of this button as per your location and then you can see uh, the entire course detail in front of you the main highlights about this course are there are five sessions 10 chapters 22 videos 10 quizzes three assignments two live projects right and these are the two live projects that i talked about in the course and this is the entire syllabus which covers everything from the very scratch to doing your own projects on stock analysis and investment portfolio creation and guys if you use the code rtk40 then you'll get an instant 40 percent discount the course is very affordable right now and the prices will go up eventually so i highly recommend you guys to register and i'll see you in that course coming back to the code let's now incorporate the stop loss condition as well so sl is equal to input dot float and let's just write five and the title is stop loss in percentage right so we are just providing five percent 
the stop loss here. So if strategy dot position size is greater than zero, then in that case, we'll open an exit order here. ID is long exit from and from entry, which is long, right? Comment can be long stop loss. And now stop is equal to strategy dot position average price multiply by one minus it's a long order. So definitely yeah, it's one minus SL divided by 100. And same goes with the short order as well. If strategy dot position size is less than zero, then in that case, we'll create a strategy dot exit and then short uh, ID is short exit from entry, which is short comment is short stop loss and stop price is equal to strategy dot position average uh, position average price multiply by one plus stop loss divided by 100. Oh, actually, this one should be here. Perfect. Now let's just save this code. Let's see what is the final result. Perfect. So uh, if I just maximize this particular graph, you can see the positions are being taken correctly. As I can see, it's buying when the prices are going down and selling when the prices are going up. The long positions are getting closed, short positions are getting closed, and I think it looks great. So, but the final result will be analyzed on the strategy tester only. So let's go there. Perfect. So uh, our total close trades is 357, which is quite decent. Percent profitability is still not great which is 62.18 percent maximum drawdown is 72.4 percent uh, average trade is 1.65 percent so i'll have to play with some, with the inputs now perfect so i actually change the inputs uh, to be atr is equal to 21 atr multiplier is equal to 1 atr period 2 is 20 and 2.1 is the multiplier 2 stop loss percent is 5 percent only so when we click ok here the percent profitability is 70 percent plus total number of close trades is quite decent profit factor is amazing which is around 12 maximum drawdown is much better now which is around 30 percent and yes, we are making more than 1% in every trade on an average. So it looks like a great strategy and yes, definitely it can be considered for our further analysis. This is not an investment recommendations, guys. Uh, I'm just making this video for educational purpose. But yes, definitely you can consider this particular code for your further analysis. So guys, if you are interested in getting this particular code and not only this one, the other codes as well on my PineScript strategies and some of my Python projects, then I share my Google Drive with my community members. So how to get an access of my Google Drive. But yeah, before that, guys, if you liked even one thing about this particular video, then you should click on that like button because it really helps with the algorithm. And if you guys want me to involve in your personal projects, then guys, I provide freelancing services as well. Just write to me on this particular email address and I'll reach out to you as soon as possible. And also, as I mentioned, there are many more videos that are coming on this YouTube channel. You should click on the subscribe button also hit on the bell icon. The next video that I'm uploading is on Doji trading strategy and you won't believe it has given me great results as well. The video will be live on Saturday 3 p.m. India time and let's come back to see how to get an access of my Google Drive. Guys, just go to my YouTube channel and click on that access to my Google Drive button and over there you just follow some basic details and you'll see that the cost of my Google Drive is less than a third of a coffee price. So you should definitely consider being a part of my Google Drive community. I'm charging this small amount of money because I hired a couple of interns who are trying their best to provide the best possible services to the Google Drive community members. Thank you so much guys for watching this video till the end. You can click here to subscribe to my YouTube channel and over there you'll see this entire playlist on PineScript trading strategies since the beginning and over there you'll see the most recent video that I uploaded on YouTube. Down below you can see my website. Just go there and just explore all the services that I offer to my clients and I'll see you in the next video with Doji trading strategy on Saturday. Till then, peace.